God, this is so fucked! Why the hell did you shoot that guy, man? What the hell was that? I didn't mean to do it. It just happened, okay? Where the fuck were you with a warning? Me? You're putting that on me now? I didn't see the guy either. I was too worried those dudes were gonna pull guns on us. Or shit! Dude, how'd they catch up to us? Who gives a shit? Just... Hurry up, Eddie! Here, man, shoot! Dude, take this thing! Get him, man! Jesus, man. Jesus. God, this is crazy. Holy shit, man, did you get him? Are they back there? Wyatt? Dude, are they there or not? Come on! Wyatt, talk words at me, man! I don't see anything. Are you sure? Those guys wouldn't just give up. I don't see anything. Here, here, I'll turn off. I feel that look on me, man. I'm not being an asshole. I'm being smart. No lights, no, uh, you know, they can't see us. Christ, I can taste blood in my mouth. I don't think it's mine. I can't see a damn thing out here. Man, I'm just, man, this is so fucked. I guess that makes sense. Yeah, it makes sense, Wyatt. God, I can't believe we're in this shit. Don't barf just yet, okay? Please, this road is really straight. We'll be fine. At least slow down. What? Fuck no. Did you see that one guy's eyes, man? He's fucking gorked. I don't want that guy in my life, Wyatt. Dude, you are covered in that guy's blood. I know, Wyatt. My shirt is soaked. It's like, I just, why didn't they say anything? The guy's taking his shit over there. That's all they had to say. Did you mean to pull the trigger? I don't know. I was so keyed up, I just, damn it. Look, Wyatt. All I know is those guys had me all jacked up, like I was on speed or something. I was just on edge, you know? But then I was like watching that guy's brains come out of the back of his head. Sorry, man, I... Well, thanks for getting us out anyway. Let there be light, huh? Dude, shut up. See? It's fine. Road straight as my dick. You think we're in the clear? Not till we get out of this fog. Was that a pun? No. When did you start making puns? I said no, idiot. I know. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's Tom Cruise out of here. Please never talk again. See if there's still any sticky in the glove box. I don't see anything. Dude, it's in there. Look harder. I don't see it. What I do see is that ammo that you lost last week. Oh my god, really? But is there any weed? You know, one time I was going out with this girl, right? Abigail. You remember her. And she told me that... She I think loading the gun is probably more important right this second. Thanks. Okay. Weird, but okay. Shit! Holy shit, dude. Holy shit. Did you get a look? I think that was a guy. Wyatt, come on, man, say something. Was that a dude or not? What the... The fucking fog. This night is so fucked, man. I think it... I think he was alive. Let's see if there's anything around the car. You know, anything that'll like tell us one way or the other. 
That way we can just book. But I'm not leaving if we hit a human being, man. I'm just not. Man, don't roll it down broken. I can't see through the cracks. Look, it's fine, see? Dude, what's that on the broken side mirror? It's part of a shirt, I think. Yeah, but plenty of dead guys have shirts on. Keep looking. You think that blood on the windshield is fresh or rotten? Is that the mirror from the car? Can't tell from here. What's that way out in the road? Does that blood look fresh to you? Yeah, but it's kind of dark. Yeah. Damn. Man, I'm really not seeing anything. Seriously, you think some piece of that guy made it into the glove box? Man, I don't know. Stop messing around. We need to know what's going on, okay? That's not gonna help. Okay, okay. Jeez. Look. Wyatt. It was a guy. Are you sure? Yes. How sure? Pretty fucking sure. Don't pay for sex drunk, sure. Jesus. So what do we do? What do you mean, what do we do? We go out there. There's no way I'm getting out of this car. Forget it. What if that was you, man? After all this shit that's happened in the past couple months, where's your compassion, motherfucker? Come on, man. This is stupid. We go out there, we check it out, we get moving. You go if you want. Want? Why would I want to? I just... We just have to. That's all there is to it. Okay. Well... Shit, okay. Here, we'll rock, paper, scissors for it. Fine. Okay, cool, good. This is good. We need to hurry up. You ready? Man, I can't believe I'm doing this shit. Dude, two seconds, it's over. All right, two out of three, right? Sure. One, two, three, go. All right, all right, okay, all right. One, two, three, go. Scissors? Who fucking picked scissors? Looks like it's me. alone, all right? This is my speed. Eddie! You see something? You should get back in the car! No fucking way, man! What if it was you? Stop harping on me to fucking leave. We're not going anywhere until I see what's up with this guy, okay? Here, in case we need to get out of here quick. Way to go, idiot! Hey, Wyatt. I ate paint when I was a kid. Die. Shit, where the hell do they go? This is the smallest hoopty in the world. There you are, you piece of shit. Why didn't he just leave them in the ignition? Come here, you little bastard!
Damn it. I told you. I already told you it wasn't me, man. Man, come on. I told you like like 20 times. I don't even I don't even know your bro. What's your problem, man? Well, relax. It's not your fault. What the hell, man? What? You know. Cut it out. Jesus, you guys. You gonna make me? Yeah. Hey, Vince! Justin's gonna make me! It's too hot for this shit. Vince! I'm making him hot now! Settle down, assholes. He started it. Hey, man. How about you open a fucking window? It's a prison bus, asshole. The window. Hey, open. Justin. That shit ain't see that right, guy man. in the beat up that truck? Shit ain't right. I'll bet Shut he lives in that there. truck now. You probably got his whole house. Life savings. Shit. I bet you stole his dog. You steal his dog, man? I wasn't stealing from guys like that. Anyway, better than stealing his virginity. Hey, how many times I gotta tell you? Here we go. Seriously, I was falsely accused. How old was she, 15? Damn it, it ain't like that. You telling me there wasn't a star witness waiting around in your white van? I'm shocked. We're all in the same boat here. What's the point of arguing? The point is, I'm not like that. My lawyer's gonna be hearing Tell about you what, this. Guys, he gonna have your afraid to say it. jobs when he I'm hears really about this. I'm really missing my girlfriend right now. You I'm guessing she's pretty pissed nerve, at you. Man. It's I worse than that, man. She won't talk to mouth. me. I haven't heard her voice in months. Really messing with me, like for real. Just let it go, man. I want to, but you know, I love her, man. What's it matter, man? You're headed to jail. Never heard of a conjugal visit? Danny, I know you don't realize this because you're you, but you probably ruined that poor girl's life, you piece of shit. Big talk from white collar back there. How many lives you wrecked, kid? Who cares? Hotter than hell up in here. I'm getting dehydrated. Hey, how about some water back here? Shut I up thought you took the there. stand and cried your eyes out. I'm telling you again. Didn't you lose your yeah, shit man, and tell them you didn't know what you were doing? Or I'll shut you I up. lied. Turns out I'm good at that. You lied on the stand? See, that's the kind of shit I could never do. Religious? No, nah, man. Watch a lot of cop shows? Nope. What then? It just ain't right. I gotta admit, I'd say anything to get out of doing more time. You guys are messed up. Says the criminal. You wanna know the funny thing? I don't regret any of it. I carried my victims for years. They knew what they were getting into. And now here I am, and there they are. And Wall Street assholes pulling the same scores are smiling on TV. Fuck that. How did it all work, anyway? It was like, a uh, A pyramid scheme. Fuck Wall Street. Fuck Wall Street. Fuck Wall Street. How much did you make off with, anyway? Enough. So, like, a couple hundred K? A little over a hundred. Million. God damn, boy! Ho oh, ho! When we get out of here, you, me, and Vince, we gotta go into business, know what I'm saying? You know, I don't actually know a thing about you, Vince. Maybe he's a priest. Yeah, Father Vincent. I bet he touched a kid. I helped my little brother. They send you to prison for that now? He was in trouble. I had to help him out. I knew it was something stupid. You regret it, man? If you're saying what I think you are, I got respect for you, man. Doesn't really matter. What's done is done. I hear you. How'd they get you? Threw the gun in the trash. And? 
Some stupid dog knocked the can over the next day. Kid found it and turned it in. You, know you what gotta be is? kidding me. This is man, you're bad luck, Vince. Punishment, man. Bad Violate luck, Vince. My motherfucking <laughs> That's not I'm bad. You, man. What do you think, Shut Justin? The fuck up. What the fuck are you gonna do about fuck it? Fuck you. Fuck me? <laughs> fuck you, motherfucker. Oh, oh shit! Oh, man. What the hell is going on, man? Gregory, knock it off! Hey, get in there, man! Hey, let him go, man! Hey, Damn it, Crab Tree! Don't make me come back! He's gonna kill him, Vince! Let the guard handle it, guys. Fuck that! We gotta get in there! You do oh, not wanna get down, in the middle huh? of that shit, Danny. Oh, fuck him, Vince! We gotta do something. You know this ain't right. I'm not doing any more time to save some stupid ass. Where's her empathy, man? Where's your oh, common sense, Christ? Help him, Danny! What's that? Speak up, boy. I can't get chains too short! Crabtree, I'm warning you one He's last time, man. Damn it. You gotta get, get in there. Get yourself in there and wake that shit up, Come on, man. Come on, boy. Get back there. Okay, asshole. Let him go. Get in between them, goddammit. He's gonna kill that boy. I Knock him out. Let him go, goddammit. What the fuck was that? Fuck. Jesus. What happened? What did you do, boy? God damn it, boy. Answer me back that there. That guy's still alive. Get those cuffs off him, man! What the hell was that? He he made a move on me! I, I, I don't know! This is crazy. Nobody had to die. This is what happens when you give guns to assholes. He's, uh... Fuck! Fuck! You gotta call someone, man! What? I'm calling this in! No! Don't call it in yet. Just, just wait, okay? Just give me a damn minute. Dispatch, come in. You killed that guy. You gotta deal with it, man. I just need a minute. I need a minute to think. You ain't got a minute. Shut up, you hear me? Just shut your mouth. Okay, okay, calm down. Take it easy. Quit waving that thing around before you get someone else killed. Oh, you gonna get smart with me now? Vince! It's okay. Just back off. We all need to take it down a notch. You really want to pull that trigger again, son? Thanks, man. What the fuck? the hell out of here. You're not going anywhere. Fuck that. Get this bus moving. Hey, drive. I said Let's go, we're man. staying right here. We're safe inside the bus. Nothing's gonna Holy oh, shit. Jesus. Oh my god. Hey. Hey, you need to call someone. You hear me? We need to Did he just bail on us? Oh, Jesus. What the hell, man? Back up, back up. Fuck. Fuck! Fuck! He can't reach us. Are you sure about that? That ankle's gonna get. Shit. What are we doing, guys? Come on! We gotta do something! I'm trying to think. Find a weapon. What kind of weapon? Where's the guard's gun? Yeah. Yeah, the gun. Good thinking, Justin. Where the fuck is it? I think he fell on it. It's underneath. Oh, fuck me. Get the gun, man! Get up, Vince! Hurry up! Shoot this asshole, Vince! Do it! Oh! Watch it, man! Sorry. Sorry. Man. I can't believe this shit. Can you believe this shit, man? No. We gotta find some way to get out of here. How are we gonna get out of here? We can maybe get out through the front of the bus, if that cage door is unlocked. If we can get out of these chains. We should just wait for help. Need those keys. Where are the damn keys, man? They weren't on him. Well, shit, if the keys aren't on him, then where the hell are they? He must have left them up front. 
Maybe we finally caught a break. Danny, Hey, don't. buddy! <gasps> what the fuck? God damn it, Danny. You always put your fucking foot fuck in. you, man. We gotta get out of here before any more of them show up. That's not gonna hold. Vince! Fire the fucking gun! Whoa, whoa, watch it. Ain't gonna work. Be away. Can't we just shoot off the chains? No way. Wouldn't cut through. What about the cuff? If we shoot one of those off, the chain will slip right out. Are you fucking insane? What do you think is gonna happen if you fire a shotgun that close to someone's foot? Well, what do you think is gonna happen if we don't get the fuck out of here? Vince, give me the gun. We gotta do this. Back off. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Vince! What the fuck? You're gonna do... Sorry, buddy. No, 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 you can't! Vince, I have a family. Please. Oh! 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 oh Shit! Oh, oh. Still attached. Again! Do it! Oh! 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 oh. oh. Let's go! Let's go! Oh! 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 Got like 60 miles left, I think. Ain't shit. Shouldn't have maybe taken so many cans. Ugh, 63 miles to go. Ah, I missed the days of taking shortcuts. Hey! You getting up? Good. Should probably hurry. Shit, shit, shit. I see anything weird? I'm running my ass off. Bang! I just killed you. You're either stupid as fuck or you think you're tough shit. Or both, I guess. I don't want no trouble. Please. Standing out here like this ain't gonna get you nothing but trouble. Just leave me alone, please. I'm not hurting no one. How do I know that? Maybe you're just walking this highway looking for some tail. You're gonna end up hurting somebody. Maybe killing you right now does our troubled country some good. But honestly, I ain't no do-gooder. I'm gonna let you live. Okay. So you have some balls on you just standing there like that. You get killed eventually. Ain't none of my business. I won't. What's your name? Don't matter. What? You don't like the name, Russell? Well, maybe that's just the name of the guy you or your homies robbed, huh? 
I don't care who you steal from, if you did. Maybe you're in a gang that likes to rob people. I don't know. Are you in a crew? You got some boys wearing hoodies I gotta worry about? Because you steal from me and I'll get your throat out. I don't care who you run around with, you understand? I'm not in a gang. It's fucking racist, man. Hey, now, I ain't no racist. I just call them like I see them. Just get in the car. You're gonna get eaten out here otherwise and I'm bored. Come on. Scoot. I ain't gonna wait forever. Nah, I'm good. Thanks. I don't want to ride. Jesus. Don't be so damn sensitive. I said I'm good. Fine. Change your mind? Hell yeah, get in, let's tear it up. Name's Nate, by the way, thanks for asking. You thirsty? Uh... Here you go. Good shit, ain't it? Hell of a kick, but it takes the edge off. You'll get used to it. Actually, I think that's it for me. I'm good. Alright, fine. You wanna tell me about where you come from at least? You must have been with a crew. Any tail back where you come from? Maybe drop you off, do a double back. No, uh, tail. Damn. I retract my question. There was a girl who I liked, all right? The argument's semantics, Russ. Give a pal the deets. All right. There was seven of us. I didn't have any family there or nothing. They're all at my grand's down in Statesboro. There was a dad who had a daughter about my age. One guy said he used to be a cop, but nobody really believed him. Then a teacher and his wife. The leader was this guy. Steve. Go back to the daughter. Steve was a bad dude, but everybody was with him, you know? He said seven was the magic number, so we didn't add nobody to the group. If we found survivors, it was the same every time. He... He... Let it out, Paco. Just... We gonna kill these folks and take this stuff or what? Then bang! They'd be dead! Anyway... I couldn't handle that. After weeks of it, I packed my shit up and figured I could make for Grands alone and try to find my family. I slipped out of there. I couldn't live like that. So nobody got down with the daughter then? No, they didn't. What would you give her? Strong six? Just tell me something about her. How was the rat? Give me a little something. Just a taste. Russ, I'm doing you a service here. I gotta get my beak wet. I'll put it right in here. Sure, whatever. Sure, whatever? Come on. All right, maybe someone who wasn't so near and dear to your heart did. What the fuck? Come on. The other one to dead. What do you think? Russ! I haven't before she was around, right? Damn. Here, get a look. Let's look for some supplies in here. 
See if we can fill up while we're at it. Don't be mad. Fine, be mad. Just stop being a pussy. I... Oh, shit! Go! Get out! Russ! Get the fuck down, man! You don't want to be there! Get to the truck! I'll cover you! Okay, get ready! Don't stop running! And keep your head down! What happened to I'll cover you? Look how good you did. All right, what are we gonna do? First, we're gonna figure out exactly where this asshole is. Just get a quick glance. Down! See? Easy. Now we know where he is, we can fucking get him. All right, yeah. That's the spirit. Let's push this truck for cover. Okay. It's in neutral. Just keep your head down. Shit! Just keep pushing! Shit! Push! Uh, End of the road. What now? We're gonna get around the side of the building. We gotta go from cover to cover. Seriously, this time. I'm not fucking around. You gonna cover me? If we get to that car, we'll be out of the line of fire. Here. You can cover me first. I'm not fucking around. You cover me, then I'll cover you. Or if you wanna go first, that's fine too. I'll go first. Attaboy, Russ. Haul ass. Alright! I'm good! Heads up! Nice! As soon as you start shooting, I'm coming! Now what? We get over there and we should be good. Go! Thanks. We're not done yet. Let's see if we can get in around back. Sneak up on this ass. Follow me. Man, what are we doing? Well, we gotta get in there. Fucker shot at us. Russell, relax, man. When this is over, we're gonna take what we can, head on down to your grams, and have a big ol' home-cooked meal, all right? Come on. Watch out for that. What's the problem? We should put it out of its misery. It's fucking dead. Come on. Feel like a big man now? Let's go. Okay, it's clear. Keep your head down and follow me. You got it. All right. We're gonna be fucking quiet. Sneak up on this son of a bitch and take him out. You hear me? Not a fucking beep. Let's go. I see him. 
Check through the window. See if there's anyone else. I think I saw a guy. No shit. Grab him. I'll cover you. Do I sneak up? Or just jump out and grab him. You're gone. the fuck out of here, you monsters! Whoa, Gramps! I told you not to come back here! Think you could just leave your mask at home? And now you're with this fucking spook! First off, watch the fucking racism. This is my boy. Secondly, I don't fucking know you. We were just passing by like anyone else. Bullshit! You came back to finish us off and take all our food! You've lost your goddamn marbles. She's dying, and now she can see your face. Shut this guy up! I can't handle this. Agreed. Look at how much progress we've made. You tried to kill us for no goddamn reason. If anything, we should take you out for that. Please, just get the fuck out of here. Please, leave us alone. What do you say, Russ? Should we just kill these folks and take all their stuff? I'm done. That's it, man. I don't know you, and I don't want to. Can't you take a fucking joke? Fuck your jokes. I'm sorry, I'm out. Come on. Can we still be friends? No. Okay, got one. A snake for a tongue. You're so bad at this. Would you rather have a snake for a tongue? Awful. Or lobster claws for hands? I swear, this is the worst one ever. You know the rules, miss. Gotta answer. Well? I'm thinking. Think harder. And how exactly do you think harder? Good point. I'll think about that. Okay, how about... Well, never mind. I probably ought to stop bugging you with stupid hypotheticals. Oh, come on. You'd be a lot less fun. You've been a lot more fun lately. Feeling better? I guess I am. Well, you sure do look better. Though, uh, you gotta admit anything is an improvement. That came out wrong. What I mean is... I mean, uh, you were, you were, uh, you know. You know, you're not perfect either, Mr. Lobster Hands. Maybe I should spend a minute listing off your flaws. See how you like it. Me? I ain't perfect? That's right. And you're older than dirt. Look, as long as you stay off that stuff, you can have all the flaws you want. I mean it, though. After we found you, you were still so hooked on that stuff, well... I never thought you'd make it. You ain't out of the woods yet, I know, but... Well, you've come a long way, Bonnie. And I'm proud of you. You're a good friend, Leland. I know. Okay, you're not that great. Look, you know I ain't going nowhere, right? As long as we're together, I'll be there for you. 
You gotta wear it. You know that, right? I know. God, Leland. Thank you. Bonnie, I... Leland? Bonnie? D. Hey, honey. I found us something. What are you two up to? Where have you been, Dee? We were just talking while we waited for you, huh? And what were you talking about? Oh, uh, well, um, lobsters. Lobsters. Well, fishing. Figured it'd be worth a shot. For the food, you know. Leland, you hate fishing. That ain't totally true. And how many days you gone fishing? What? I go fishing all the time. Thought you, didn't I? I am a catch. Don't I know it. I got you a present. Oh, you shouldn't have. What'd you find? I'll tell you later. I don't mean to interrupt your chat with your uh, girlfriend, but uh, we got to get moving. Does she think we... So, where'd you get the bag, D? D? D, did you hear me? Keep up the pace, you two. Hey, D, when we get back to camp, would you let me borrow some of that nail polish? Sure, hon. You like this color? It's my favorite. And after today, I could use a new coat, you know? Same here. I feel like a drowned rat with these claws. Not to interrupt the girl talk here, but uh, D, that, that bag. Look, I found it down the road a piece, all right? Where down the road? Some place off that away. Damn it, D, you gotta give us more than that. D, honey, where'd you get the bag? I don't understand. What's the big deal? It is a big deal, honey. You guys sure gang up on me a lot lately. Honey, that ain't true. Tell me one time you sided with me in the last week. The last month. All right. I can't remember one especially, but I know I have. False. This is how all our fights go, every time. Now we're standing here in the woods, soaking through, and for what? Don't you want to get to the camp before dark? I ain't the one who stopped. Hush, your voice but is you down. you are the Come one on who now. made me stop. Irregardless, we could just as easy carry on like this while we're walking. Oh, I've about had it with that attitude. Attitude? And now we're standing in this goddamn rain, in this goddamn middle of nowhere you did place. That on purpose. You listen to me now. I have had it up to I here with listening to you. To I can't believe you are... Shut up, D. Leave Leland alone. This ain't your business, Bonnie. This is between him and me. Enough, D. She's right. We're acting like a couple kids. That's just because you ain't listening. Bonnie, darling, I'm, I'm sorry we're... Darling? D, come on. Save it. I know what side your bread is buttered on. Yours, too. D, now's not the time. Whatever issues we got, we'll hash them out later. It's always later. I'm sorry. I just want to get somewhere where I can change my clothes, and then you and your girlfriend can... Oh, shit. Oh, no. Oh, God, run. Come on, we gotta move. What are you talking about? Oh, shit. So fast! Oh! I'm falling back! Oh! Damn 
thing out here. Anybody got anything? God damn it. Shit. Where are you? I don't see shit out here. Where the hell? Anything? No! I can't see a damn thing out here! Oh, Mama, watch over me. Okay, Bonnie. Stay calm. Find a weapon. Bonnie. <gasps> D? Oh, God, D! I I'm so sorry. Oh, God! <laughs> Why? You. Why? It was dark. It's so dark. I, I couldn't see you. I, I didn't know it was you. How was I supposed to know it was you? Mm -hmm. there, there was no... Mm -hmm. I thought I... <clears throat> saw you. You... you did this. Oh, God, you killed me. You, you killed me. <laughs> Anybody see anything? I should it's never... Dark out here. ...trusted you. Just... Just a junkie. <laughs> Leland. She... She did this to me. I... God, I'm so sorry. So... I can't... Oh, God! God! I knew you'd fuck up again. Take him. I... I... No, God, I'm sorry. I need him. I need you both. You... Bitch. Mary, you wanted him. Didn't... Thank you. Help the stones. Leland is just a friend. I didn't mean to do this, Dee. I swear to God. You fucking junkie. D! D, did you find her? Honey, I, I thought they got you back there. Jesus, are you shot? D! God, what happened? Oh, Jesus, oh, Lord, Bonnie, what happened? Oh, my God, D! Darling, what happened to you? It doesn't matter now, Leland. She's dead. We've got to move on. We can't stay here. I know, but just give me a minute. Tell me what happened. Keep moving. You gotta be closing in. What's done is done. We have to get going. What? What's done is done? That's all you have to say? Back this way! Uh, no! You're going! Which way? There! Call out if you see him. I think I heard something over here. Leland, come on. I ain't leaving her. They'll kill you. Leland. I think I see him. Over here.
Hey, Shell, your sister's getting pretty good, huh? Becca had a good teacher, Steph. Thank you for doing that. She needs something to focus on besides, you know, everything else. Yeah. Growing up in a world like this, what do you think that does to a kid? I'm trying to protect her from it as much as possible. Things are stable here, for now. I want her to grow up with this, not what's outside these walls. Becca's a good kid. These are shit times, and she's gonna go through that. But if we can keep her from experiencing some of the shit I've seen... Thanks, Stephanie. Thanks. Pekka, that was great. Thanks, sis. You think we can do something like this every week? As long as it doesn't distract from keeping this place safe, that's always the priority. That was amazing, Becca. We could all use a little more music in our lives. Did I ever tell you that I used to play in a band? Yes, Roman, you've told us. She doesn't want to hear about it again. All right, all right. In that case, let's get back to work. Oh, and thanks to Boyd's hard work on the vegetable garden, we're having fresh soup tonight. Okay, let's get to it. You want to help me and Shell do the supply inspection? Cool. You check the flashlights this time. I'll look over the guns. Cool. Actually, I wanted to make sure our blades were in good condition first. No rush on the flashlights. Shell, when you get a sec, meet me out back. Help me feed the watchdogs. Sure thing. Me. He's hungry. I guess he knows it's feeding time. It's disgusting. Can't disagree with you there. You know, uh, your sister said she wouldn't mind doing this. Roman, we've talked about this. Becca doesn't need to deal with this kind of thing. Listen, I know you think that giving her an easy life is what's best, but it's really not. I know, I just want her to have a little more time to be a kid. As long as she knows how to protect herself, it's fine. I don't want her to stop caring about people. Okay. What's that one eating? I don't know. I'll check it out. I gotta get back out front. Looking forward to that soup. Again. Whoa! What's your problem? I do this all the time. You don't get all pissed off. <sighs> you just... You can't go jumping out at people. Not anymore. It's not safe. But... What if I had a weapon? I could have thought you were a walker. What are you talking about? I... <sighs> Look, I... I just saw our walkers out back. 
eating a, a puppy. A puppy? Yeah. I guess it just got to me. You know, it was... it was so little. You don't think about babies anymore, but... after a while you just kind of accept this is it. Yeah. I guess you kind of forget. <laughs> right. But then, you know, there it is. You see it and you want to protect it and... And now it's gone. That sucks. Maybe if Clive dies next, we can put him out there instead. He'd make a better watchdog anyway. Becca. Shell! Becca! Something's going on outside! What is it? I don't know. Something bad. We gotta find Roman. Come here, everyone. Shit. Come on, we gotta find Roman. Let's mop them. If so, care we were. Jesus. Largum. My God, Largum. what did you do? All I did was put on the blindfold and bind his wrists. Somebody else beat him up. He already had the cuts and bruises. Watchdogs caught him trying to steal supplies. Is he bitten? No, they didn't get that close. Did he hurt anyone? No, thank God. Who is he? I don't know, and I don't think he speaks English. I can't believe he just snuck in. the second break-in we've had in the last couple of weeks. We just barely got our stuff back last time, and that had nothing to do with us. We just got lucky. Whatever went down was between them. Well, we all know what it's like trying to survive out there. He just came in here for food. Let's just give him some. We'll send him on but his what way. what if there are more of them? He could have been scouting. That's right. He could be part of a larger group. If there were more, I think we would have seen them by now. We can't take the risk of letting him go, but why not let him stay? I... I guess that would be okay. We could always use more hands keeping the place secure. Boyd, we don't need any more people here. And look at him. How is he, he gonna... He can't help? even speak English. This group works because we know how to communicate. We can find a way for him to help. <sighs> well, he's not staying here. You let in a stranger and everything starts breaking down. The last time we did that, we lost Bree. And then Vernon with that goddamn boat. Vernon and the boat are the reason the group fell apart. Not trusting strangers. Vernon was out for the boat the whole time. And the second they left that boat unattended, we just stole it. That's when our group fell apart. He can't stay here. I agree. Keeping him here is not an option. In his condition, he'd be a drain on our resources. Look, we all know what we're talking about here, so let's stop dancing around it. We either let this guy go and take our chances, or we kill him. Roman's right. It's gotta be one or the other. We're letting him go. It's the only right thing to do. I'm telling you, we can't do that. But killing him? Is that really the answer? Stephanie, Boyd, you two don't think we should kill him. We know where Joyce and Clive stand on the subject. You're the swing vote here, Shell. What's it gonna be? We have to set him free. We can't! He's not even armed! We can't just kill him! This isn't in self-defense! Isn't it, though? If it means he can't come back to hurt us? That isn't the same thing. But last time- Joyce, that was a long time ago. If we kill this man, then we're giving up a part of ourselves that we can never get back. I'm not ready to let that go. Cut him free. I hope you guys know what you're doing. Oh, Give him have? some food, when, three or four cans, just as a gesture of good faith. And get him out of here. I don't know if you can understand a word I'm saying, but you better understand this. You came this close to death today, and if you ever, ever 
come near this place again, or tell anybody where we are, you'll wish you had died today. Do you have any fours? Nope. Do you have any sevens? Yep. I miss playing guitar for everyone. It was stupid, but fun. Why don't we do that anymore? Since the attack, there's a lot we don't do anymore. I shouldn't have let that guy go. Boyd would still be alive and everything would be the same. Boyd agreed it was the right thing to do. Anyway, Roman's obsessed with keeping this place secured now. You know that's impossible, right? Well, after last time, Roman isn't taking any chances. And I should fix the loose board behind the storage lots. Becca, are you sneaking out again? Oh, God, do you know how dangerous that is? It's not dangerous. There's nothing out there but slow-ass walkers. What are you talking about? We've had two break-ins already. Anyone could be out there. What if someone sees you and, and follows you back here? They won't. Damn it, Becca. Shell, I need to talk to you. It's open. What's going on? Hey, Becca. Hey. When you, uh, get a sec, I need you to come out and talk to me. It's important. Okay. I'll be outside. You'll see me. Give us a minute. Yeah. Just don't take too long. What was that all about? Maybe he found out about the boards? Shit. You think so? If he did, I won't say anything. But you better stay away from there for a while. Okay. Stay here. It'll be just a minute. I'll fill you in when I get back. Roman? Good, you're here. What's this all about? It's Stephanie. What happened? We caught her trying to escape. Maybe she wasn't. Maybe she just wanted to get outside these walls for a while. Ever since the incident, you've made this place feel, I don't know, oppressive. We've made it safe. She was definitely trying to escape. She had most of our ammo and medicine with her. She screwed us, Shell. All of us. And now we're in that position again where we can't keep her here and we can't let her go. You do know why I'm telling you this, right? No. You and Boyd were the ones who fought to let that guy go. Convinced us all to take that chance. Well, we did. And it was wrong. And now Boyd is dead. We're beyond the luxury of taking chances now. And I need to know that you're with us a hundred percent. Let's talk to her first. See if we can talk some sense into her. No. She tried to sneak out and leave us without any medicine or extra ammo. She knew that could mean the death of any one of us. If we give her a second chance, she might not try to leave so quietly. You got your gun? It's in the camper. I'll give you a few minutes to get your head together. God, what do I tell Becca? That's up to you. Whatever you say, I'll back you up. <sighs> I'm 
Shell? What's wrong? Am I in trouble? It's Stephanie. She stole a bunch of supplies and tried to escape. Oh my god. What the hell did she do that for? Roman says we have to... Kill her? Yeah. Why would she do this to us? Doesn't matter. She did what she did. Stupid. Roman wants me to do it. I'm sorry. Let's just get it over with. Your gun's over there. In the drawer. I don't want this to be who we are. Just let me do it then. No, I'll do it. You shouldn't ever have to do something like this. I just need a second. This really sucks. Yeah, it does. You know, we don't have to do this. We can just go. What? We've survived on our own before. If we just go, we can be out of here before anyone can do anything about it. Are you crazy? Where would we go? There's nothing out there. As long as we're here, we're safe. The group will protect us. But for how long? I don't know. Longer than we'd survive out there. Besides, you know the rules. If we try to leave, Roman will hunt us down. We don't have a choice. This is who we are now. Shell. Time. We gotta do this. I don't ever want to put you in danger. If that means this is what we have to become, then it is what it is. Sorry. Me too. You were right. There are survivors out here. Still alive? Oh, they're gonna be happy to get rescued. So how many are we talking about? Around five, I think. They left a note, so at least we know they want to be found. And I can see smoke in the distance. Probably a camp. I'm gonna try to make contact tonight. So good. I'm gonna try to talk to him. Wish me luck. Yeah, good luck. Be careful. Don't try to force him into anything. Just get as many of them as you can. We should probably split up into two parties. You got it. Hey! Don't you fit! Don't fucking move! Who the fuck are you? My name is Tavia. How did you find us? I found your note. I'm a scout for a growing settlement up north. We go out and look for survivors to rescue them. We have food, 
clean water, and shelter for everyone. We're offering you a chance to help us out and start over. God, this sounds too good to be true, but I think it is. Bonnie, get real. Just because you have to tell the truth all the time doesn't mean everyone else does. If I didn't trust people, I'd be dead. I know that for sure. People can care about you if you let them. Like Leland cared when he let you run off alone? That's enough, Becca. Guys, look. If I learned one thing from Danny, it's that we have to stick together and protect ourselves. What? That guy was an asshole. You should be happy he got killed before Shell and Becca joined us. Why? Don't worry about it. Wait, you find survivors? Do you find a lot? Not as many anymore, but... Well, we gotta go. Eddie might be there. Wyatt... Look, we need people, plain and simple. You folks can decide if you want to come as a group, or split up, or whatever. But I don't want to be out here in the open after dark. So in a few minutes, I'm going to be getting back in my car and on my way. Hopefully, at least some of you will follow me. Chell, why are we even listening to her? She's obviously lying. Even if she's not, I think it's better to just keep on the move. Staying in one place makes you an easy target. I don't care how safe you think it is. That truck stop was a death trap. It was right off the highway, for God's sake. No way you and a bunch of sick old people were gonna defend it. I don't like this, guys. We should just walk away. I don't trust her. Well, why not, Russell? If they have food and medicine and... and... Yeah, medicine. Look... I don't trust her, Bonnie. Then stay here if you want. I'm not bringing anyone against their will. We only want people who want to be there. I don't understand what the problem is. Are you really considering staying out here? Foraging for food like fucking raccoons? I mean, then why did we even leave the photos there? Well, it could be a trap. What if they want to kill us? Thank you. Everyone out there is batshit crazy. We've all seen it. Well, we turned out all right, didn't we? What are we gonna do? Eat you? Are you gonna eat us? No, that was a joke. I'm sorry. Look, I know you guys are wary, and you have every right to be. You don't know me from a hole in the ground. And yeah, there are some crazy fuckers out there. All I'm here to do is make an offer. You can come with me, or you can stay here. The choice is yours. So, who wants to come with me? Yeah, I have to. I'm... I'm just not sure. We've been out here for so long and seen so much bullshit. I mean, is it really worth getting our hopes up? Of course it is, Russell. Hope is all we've got left. But being smart, that's what's keeping us alive. We have people of all ages in our colony teenagers, whole families. It's a chance to reconnect with people the way you used to. That's not true. I believe her, Becca. Look at her. This is not someone who's been struggling the way we have. It makes sense. Can you promise my sister will be safe? She'll be as safe as she was before all this happened. Shell, this might sound stupid, but I think I actually want to go. Okay. If it means that much to you. I'm glad you feel that way. We're not going to be out this way again for a long time. We understand. I think we've all made up our minds. Well, I guess we have our group. What do you want to do with these? This is a good thing. I know it is. How do we know this will work out? What's the alternative? Staying out here? <laughs> 